The gravitational pull of Saturn <laughs> reaches <laughs> deep into Enceladus, beyond its water ice exterior, gripping its rocky core. As Saturn's grasp strengthens and weakens, it massages this cold rocky heart, bringing it to geological life with frictional heat. The heat melts the ice around it, creating a vast subsurface lake. This water jets out through huge cracks in the surface ice. On Earth, where there's liquid water, there's life. You don't even know what to do. <laughs> Could Enceladus have what it takes for simple organisms to exist? Once Cassini saw these geysers, the scientists knew they had found something extremely wonderful. They actually changed the mission of Cassini itself, changed its trajectory. We sent the Cassini spacecraft to fly very, very close over these cracks where the water was rushing out. Scientists clung to the faint hope that the water would contain salts and organic molecules like ammonia, the building blocks of life here on Earth. Stunningly, Cassini sensors <laughs> tasted them all in abundance. In that plume, there's organic material. It's not water, it's a soup. That's incredible. 